Hello, it's Miss Haley, and today I have balloon rockets. So, to make our balloon rockets, we're obviously going to need one balloon. I have a red one today. String or yarn. Some tape. It could be masking tape, painter's tape, duct tape. And a straw. It can be plastic, metal, paper any kind of straw that you have, and then some scissors to cut your yarn as well. So, how do you think we're gonna make balloon rocket? Hmm, so first, if I have my string and my straw, what do you think I can do? I have to put, first I have to put my straw or my string into my straw. So it might take a little bit of finger work See it in there? You gotta inch it. You gotta pinch and then push. Oop. See, even I make mistakes sometimes. It's a little difficult. So we're gonna try again. Put the end in. Don't let go. And keep inching. So I'm pinching it right here so then I can try to push more down. See if I'm getting close. There we go, I got it out. So, now that I have this on there, I don't want to lose that. I don't want to, I want to keep it on here. Now, you need to find a space where you can connect two pieces of string to. So, you could connect one piece to a chair and one piece to a couch or anything you have that you can put tape on because we're going to tape the string to those two objects. So, then it makes like that in between. Okay, so I have two chairs that I'm going to tape my string to. I'm gonna keep the straw in the middle. So here's my straw. And then I'm gonna measure it out just to this chair right here. I want it pretty tight. chair a little bit more to make it a little bit longer of a rocket and then I'm gonna cut where my chair is so you gotta measure it out with your string and then you have to tape it to how long it needs to be okay so we've got our rocket space, but now we need the rocket itself. So what that's going to be is your balloon. So we need some help with this. Can stretch it out a little bit, big or small balloon, help get some air in there. Okay, and then we're gonna work on our breathing. Ready? Take deep breaths. How'd I do? Okay, we wanna keep this pinched at where you blew in the air, okay? You could ask for a family member's help to help you pinch it, but we gotta make sure that all the air stays in there. So I'm going to rip a couple pieces of tape, and now I'm going to need to tape my balloon to the straw. So it might be tricky. I'm gonna do it. So I'm gonna hold my balloon up to the straw and it's really important that where I want my balloon to go I have my opening of my balloon the other way. So the air is going to come out of the balloon where I put it in. So here's where I put the air in it's gonna come out this way, and then it's going to, I don't know, we'll see, but it might push it this way. So I want this end where I blew the balloon up to the chair or whatever you have there, closest to it, not facing the other way. Okay, one more piece of tape. Make sure that our balloon rocket stays on the straw. Get one more. Okay, 
Okay. Now I'm gonna let go and see what happens to our balloon. Ready? See, I could even make it even longer. Okay, so I'm gonna retry my balloon rocket one more time. I made my chair a little bit longer over there. And now I'm going to blow up my balloon. You don't have to readjust the tape unless you need to, but once you blow it back up, it should stay on there. So ready, I'm gonna blow up my balloon. Okay, I got some air in there. I'm gonna bring it back all the way to this chair. And we're gonna see how far it goes or how fast it goes this time. Ready, count me down. One, two, three. Whoa, look how fast that went. Enjoy at home.